Paul, uh, our first win up here for five years, uh, back-to-back wins, and we're up to third in the league. Um, you must be delighted with today's performance. Great, great. You know, like um, I think all week um, we had a really good week's preparation. Uh, we actually get the boys New Year's Day off as well, spend time with the family. Uh, it just kind of shows, you know, it's just down to our application in terms of our mindset because we've got good players, we've got a nice way that we play the game, uh, we defend pretty well, we've got a nice set piece that operates uh, effectively. Uh, and, you know, the players believing in themselves and having the courage to play and uh, to come up to a fast track like this at Kingston Park, uh, to score five tries, um, you know, it's tremendous and showing that our attacks move in the right direction as well. Going back to the start of the game, uh, when Max Crumpton went over, then we're scoring intercepts and then a really well worked try, the last two in the game, um, the last two in the first half. That must be massively delighting that we're scoring pretty much from all over the pitch. It is. Look, you know, I thought defence today was, was, was largely excellent. You know, we, we dropped off a little bit in the second half, which I suppose sometimes is understandable. And uh, for the players, you know, I'm, I'm delighted that we got the result. They, they thoroughly deserve it. And, uh, you know, a special mention, of course, to Mike Brown. He's 308th game for the club. You know, what a career he's had and what a career he's still going to have with us. Um, you know, fantastic. And to get the win for him on this day was really special because we didn't quite do on his 300th and Danny's 250th against Saracens a while back. So for me, I'm really happy about that. Um, you know, and it's, it's us knowing that in the second half, you know, we have to know that we can close teams out, you know, really efficiently and really well. And uh, as a defence coach, as always, I'm disappointed to concede two tries because we were better than that today. We were much the better team for me. And uh, we still have two or three tries out there, which is, again, really pleasing. You know, we're, we're a team that's starting to find some kind of form, some kind of continuity and uh, belief and resilience. You know, and we, we go into Europe with, uh, with, with real confidence. Going into the next two weeks, so we're back at the Stoop next week against Grenoble and a great opportunity to seal our place in the quarterfinal over the next two games. That's it. You know, and we really appreciate, obviously, the crowd that, that came up to support us today. You know, we're, you know handshaking a, a lot of Harlequin supporters. You know, it's a, it's a long trip up to Newcastle from London and, uh, you know, we're really thankful for the guys that made the effort because their support counts and uh, hopefully they can see that the, the, the performance from the team, that they want to fight for everything. And uh, you know, it'd be great that next week we get a full house uh, at home, at, at our home, at the Stoop, and uh, get the result that we need so we can kick on in both competitions because you know, we, we get some more wins on the, on, on the way here then it really puts us in a strong position in, in Europe and obviously domestically.